Today, I'm going to talk about the impact of interest rate increases on home affordability. Hi, this is Rich Fleming with EastBayHomesTeam.com, part of Realty One BMC Associates here in the San Francisco East Bay. I want to thank you for taking a couple of minutes checking out my latest video blog. Today, I'm going to talk about the impact of interest rate increases on home affordability, or to be a little bit more specific, how increases in interest rates impact your monthly mortgage payment. So before I jump into that, I want to point out two links here on the page. If you are a property owner and you'd like to get an estimated value of your property, please click on the free home values report link. If you are a potential buyer and would like to search all of the available properties in the greater East Bay area, please click on the search all properties link below. So let's jump into today's subject. How do interest rate increases impact your monthly mortgage payment? Well, the first thing I would do to really understand the impact of a, an interest rate increase is to find an online interest rate increase calculator. You can go on to Bing, you can go on to Google, type in uh, interest rate change calculator, and a number of them pop up. I happen to use one from a British uh, financial institution called NatWest. If you type in NatWest rate change calculator, you will uh, get their rate change calculator. They use British pounds as opposed to U.S. dollars, but the math is all the same. So let me give you an example. If you have a $500,000 mortgage and today's interest rate is 4%, but you don't lock it in, you don't get that rate locked, tomorrow the rate increases to 5%, a 1% increase. What does that mean? What kind of change is that to your monthly mortgage payment? So that 1% uh, increase changes your monthly mortgage payment by almost $300 a month or about $3,600 a year. So when a bank looks at that and is looking to see what your ability to repay that loan is, they use something called a debt-to-income ratio. And most banks use a ratio of about 40%. What that means is your debts can only be about 40% of the income you bring in, your gross income. So if your annual mortgage payments increase by about $3,600, your income to qualify for that mortgage has to increase by about $9,000. So as you can see, a 1% increase can have a fairly significant impact on uh, how many people can qualify for that mortgage. So this impacts, obviously, buyers, but it also impacts sellers. It will, an increase in interest rates impacts the number of people who can potentially qualify to buy your property. So if you have questions about this or any other real estate questions, please feel free to email me or give me a call. I do appreciate your time. I want to also thank Chris Dyer of Guild Mortgage who provided uh, some of the background information for this uh, video blog. Thank you for your time, and I look forward to working with you to solve your real estate needs. Thanks.